a short video of a new dog every time. Your photo on Photoshop will make a pixel effect. So this is uh, the edited image I have edited. So I'll show how to do that. Take a picture and select your area which you want to edit. So you can write some image. It is uh, somewhere else. So I need to select uh, my area by using the lasso tool. By using magnetic lasso tool or uh, you can use anything. So I think while you are there going to use Photoshop then I can uh, know that how to select the Photoshop because I don't have much more time to explain about that so I have already selected so next after selecting right click you right click on that right click on that then you get the third option for that so the high definition photo so you can uh, give that two I mean your uh, cutter radius is okay so now open a new image, new empty image, control M, this shortcut with control M, will get a dialog box. So you can choose over uh, there, there is uh, width and height and resolution, that is uh, 1024 into 768 by resolution 72. So after uh, entering that, or you can choose your present size, it is over there, uh, yeah, over here, 1024 into 576 or 1024 into 768 I need here 1024 into 768 ok I move I use new tool to move my uh, image to new empty image so I move after move so press control plus T it is a transform uh, shortcut so you can transform your image to smaller size as your wish and your ideas of everything yeah ok I have transformed my image to a smaller size so by clicking a right click you can uh, see free transform uh, everything else so I want this image from left side so I click horizontal so the image is ready to edit then then uh, duplicate your layer layer set up for the layer uh, dialog box you will be given with the first layer and background so duplicate your uh, first layer the right click will get the uh, delete layer or duplicate uh, you can duplicate your layer so we give this as uh, so I have two layers, layer 1 and layer 2. I will remove my layer 2 to some uh, to adjust. So again by clicking control key you can uh, transform your image. You know that how to transform. Okay, I will do this as more the mode on width. Okay. So your layer first I mean original layer should be at the top. Then with the uh, after that I second layer. Then I background. So this is how. If I hide the second layer, so the uh, first layer must be at the top. Top. So create layer mask to two layers as uh, layer one and layer two. Create two layer masks. So for layer one, layer one mask, uh, the background color should be white. And for layer two, the background color should be black. So then you can edit. So now you can see that uh, you can see that uh, in your left right side. But layer 1 and layer 2 layer 1 is uh, layer mask is white and layer 2 layer mask is black so after that select a brush tool and a brush size or uh, shape I am going to load a square brushes because it is a pixel effect so you need a pixel as a square so I will load square there will be many squares there I'll take uh, some of 10 uh, or 11 uh, I'll, I'll, take, I'll go for 10 to sell this 10 so then uh, you can choose your brush styles over here uh, 
Google for Zero addresses. So we take the best styles here. Shape and dynamics and scattering. So the contacts yes. And shape and dynamic guys. Your vicious angles. Uh, you can see the you can see the uh, difference between that. Okay, after that, take your brush and just move it over here. Cell effect to my second layer, so I select my first layer and do it same here, but it should be a background color white. So check your background color white and do foreground color white. Sorry, a foreground color is white and the background color is black. So do it here. So you want to know that it is moved from the, uh, the place to place. So select the layer two, then go to filter and styles. You get a win style. I mean, I can check over that. I will select move from left and okay. So you can watch that it is moved from left. Same that. Go to layer one. subscribe